And good morning, Deirdre and Teo. What's interesting about that statement is what the mayor is now considering regarding public safety. Some might find it deeply thought provoking, others could find it controversial. Take a look. Let's just begin with what has been going on this week here in Stockton since the start of the week. Four homicides. That brings the total number of murders in this city so far this year to more than two dozen. A stark change from a big drop in violent crime last year. So in a statement released last night, the mayor said in part, quote, all life is sacred and even one homicide is too many. Overall crime continues to trend downward, but we must remain vigilant, end quote. But here's the headline I found from that statement, and it's that the mayor is exploring two ideas to bolster public safety efforts. One of the ideas is out of Detroit. It's called Project Greenlight. That's a program where police set up live cameras inside and outside of area businesses to keep watch on those areas in real time from police headquarters. The second is Richmond's Advance Peace. This is the one that could be a bit more controversial because it's a program where taxpayers could end up paying young men with firearm histories to not shoot guns in exchange for adult fellowship, mentorship, and job opportunities. Now again, back here live at City Hall, the mayor is expected to attend a small business meeting that was previously scheduled here at City Hall unrelated to these murders, but it will be interesting to see if he has more to say about either of these two ideas and especially that one uh, from Richmond, which has shown some success, at least some anecdotal success at curbing violence there in exchange for actually paying young men to not shoot one another. Live in Stockton, Mike Tassell, KCRA 3 News.